Hi, it's Kim Petrus, and this is my timeline. So I went to this like Japanese convention with like one of my friends and there were a lot of like bands whose names I can't even pronounce so that was my first concert which is really unimpressive and like not eventful. I can't lie about it, I can't be like name somebody great I've seen later on. Um, yeah, but like I guess my like first like really good concert was the Spice Girls. Yeah. My first designer piece was like this little Dior uh, makeup ring. It had like two colors of eyeshadow in it, like pink and blue, and it like a ton of rhinestones. So I remember buying that and just like loving it so much. Um, yeah, so a Dior makeup ring. 2004. I love that I'm wearing like 2004 Dior as I'm telling you this. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like the year of the, of the eyeshadow rings. It was probably something around eight or nine or something like that, that I was just like obsessed with the idea of becoming a pop star. Yeah, I, I always used to like dance around in my room and like sing along, you know, lip sync to songs. Like run around in like dresses and like with whatever and just, yeah, dress up and pretend to be a pop star. Before that, I wanted to become an Imagineer. Uh, like a Disney like roller coaster designer, but you have to be like an actual engineer to do that. So I was like, well, I suck at math. So by that dream, you can't just like imagine and not engineer. <laughs> so I was like, well, I'm gonna become a pop star. I met Charlie XCX um, at the Sophie show. I think it was last year, at the end of last year. Um, Sophie is an incredible artist and um, yeah, we just like ran into each other, like went to the same party afterwards and then she texted me the next day and was like, hey, I have this song, do you want to jump on it? I went into the studio the next day, did the verse, sent it to her, she was like, I love it and done. So it, it was really great. Um, my favorite memory with her is probably I performed at her Pop 2 show. Um, here in New York, which was amazing, and it was so much fun. She, um, we sang Unlock It together, and then we sang I Don't Want It At All together, and we both just like strut around the stage and like did the catwalk thing on stage and harmonized. It was such a cute moment. Yeah, I, I'm obsessed with her. 20, 30, five. I, I, I'll, I'll hopefully tour a lot. I'll hopefully have like my 20th album out. I'll have a bunch of number ones under my belt. I'll, I'll have a thousand wig changes at my shows. Like my face will be like taped back really tight. Um, yeah, I, I hope that's me in 2035. So uh, face tape, 2035 face tape. Great, thank you guys. <laughs> this is my timeline, it looks really sparse. Not much happened in my life yet. Um, but yeah, I hope it's going to. And I'm looking forward to 2035. And uh, thanks. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more videos from your favorite artist. And while you're here, check out these other videos.